Hello, I am Flash Isaac. This is Flash Lenas. You are now watching More Than 20 Days to Jam, a series containing more than 20 episodes which covers all the topics in Jam syllabus. Each episode comprises detailed class, questions, and homework. The questions and homework are from the Flash Lenas Jam application. This makes the app a requirement for this class. Visit Google Play Store or flashlearners.com to get the app. Do you have trust issues? Reach me on any of my social handles for activation guide or inquiries. Ladies and gentlemen, it is time. You're welcome to episode number 45 of the 120 days to jam use of English with Flash Isaac. In this episode, we shall be taking a look at sentence completion questions set in jam and we are making use of the flash learners jam application if you've not gotten your copy you are wrong if you've gotten your copy you are correct and this question says here is mr odumosu who teaches english dash in our class this question is to test your spelling your ability to spell the question is, can you spell? In one of the episodes tagged Lessons and Structure, I listed the top spelling questions set in Jam, and pronunciation is one of them. The undoing of many candidates is that they take it to be pronunciation, pronunciation. No, it's actually not <laughs> pronunciation, it's pronunciation. And the correct spelling for pronunciation is P R O N U N C I A T I O N. Pronunciation as seen in option B. Option A is the wrong spelling. Option C is the wrong spelling. Option D is another wrong spelling. Tyre could have supplied the goose, but it was dashed into two. Now, don't say splitting, don't say splitting, and don't say it was split. The correct thing is, it was split. Split is the past participle of split. It remains. Tire could have supplied the goose, but it was split into two. Please sit on the carrier. This is another spelling question. Now you see parents, they put baby inside something. You see the children, they sit there, they are so relaxed. So that is carrier. Please sit on or where you can sit down. Sit, generally. If I say sit on the carrier, the A is not the carrier we are talking about. A speaks of job, profession. We are not talking about B and we are not talking about D. We are talking about option C. The teacher gave me dash of good advice. Now, advice is a no count now. No count now. So a lot is most suitable for this case. We cannot say a few or a month or many advice since it is on count. We simply say a lot of. The teacher gave a lot of. Advice option C is the most appropriate. And the scholar examined that of the subjects. Okay, okay. Now, I don't know if you've seen something like this 20 man shall fall one day, a 12 man committee, or a 20 man committee, not 20 men. Or something. When you have compound, these are compound noun. When you have two words joined like this with dash, you need not put a uh, plural here. Twenty mark committee simply means committee made up of twenty persons. And in this case, the analysis is a three-part analysis. Option C is wrong because there is no dash. 
If there is no dash, then you should put plural next to it. But so long as there is dash, they are compound ways. Option B is wrong because part 3 analysis isn't appropriate. So a three-part analysis is correct. A three-part analysis. The, school, the scholar examined a three-part analysis of the subject. And finally, yesterday, my mother asked me if I was tired. Yesterday, she asked me if I was tired. So it's already it's past. We can't use present. And that is it. That is it. This brings us to the end of this episode. For your assignment, get a flash and write app, study questions under sentence completion. And if you have problems, feel free to reach me on my social handles. My own is to help you. So who much is given should not run away with it. It's what you have in your head that takes you ahead, not the size of your head. This is why you don't need a big head to move ahead.